Hello everyone and welcome to a Nations Cup highlights of my race um, last night or the 20th of January. So this is a race of, called a race to, uh, road to recovery so to say. So we're off on the start of the race and literally immediately I get damaged. I uh, unfortunately hit the guy in front. I'm going to quickly check and see if it was my fault or his or is it just a racing incident because it is turn one but I am all over the place. But we're going to go back now to the Canadian. He gets a good start as well as I do and we get to, he's just going to try to be careful but I think he breaks a bit too early like slams his brakes on to make sure he doesn't punt anyone but unfortunately I hit him. So there's a bit of a cluster with him coming out of them two corners. But we come back to me now and as you can see I have got front uh, wing damage and uh, right wheel damage which you can see right now I am losing pace already and I cannot uh, carry on with this for the next uh, 13 to 14 laps because I will just go further and further down the field so already starting 8th I am dropped down to 12th so I am quickly thinking to myself is there anything I can do is there any, anything I can try to see if I can pull something out of the hat out, out of it but I have a little contact with Rick, uh, Rick Slick but uh, nothing major we all carry on no damage uh, more, no further damage shall I say to my wing so I thought to myself do you know what it's my last it's my last race um, of the night I'm gonna go for a two stop so I thought okay right we got uh, luckily I'm on my mediums we, we have got rogue one on the left side I need to get into the pits I'm going for the pits now so I've had to let off the accelerator and off we go so we're gonna go and do a two stopper two soft stints <laughs> soft stints sorry um, and we're going to superly fast forward it and off we go. So I think we have two other people who've done the exact same thing. I don't know whether they got damage or not as well as me, but they've gone as well. So D Will and M777, them two, uh, you know, we were up the, up quite, uh, quite up the field, sorry. And now we are, you know, basically the last three. And I need to really, really think to myself because if you look at the map we are very very far behind I think we were 28 seconds behind but we're not going to skip to lap 5 and we have caught up um, caught up but Rogue is going to the pits because I think he got some damage so he's probably done the next uh, same tactic as well but oh Lord D will nearly lost it there how did he hold on to that unbelievable great great save there I have to say but that makes me wonder now, if he if he's gonna be a bit squirmish, I need to get past him quick. So I'm gonna to have to use my overtake down here. And he's gonna get oh did he, did he gone again! Oh my days, but here we go, we're gonna go for it now. We're gonna try and overtake him down the straight. This is like the Lewis Hamilton moment when he was doing it a couple of years a couple of years back, he started from the back, and pretty much this straight is the greatest overtaking in two center S's as we go down nicely and we keep that position nicely so we are now 13 and we have still got a long way to go emerging to lap 7 we are right behind M777 and 90s and M77 takes over the 90s 90 breaks early and I've all tried luckily avoided it but uh, one fail enough but I go on the grass and I've had to work all that again they're, now, they're literally scarfed off I'm now got day tires as well but as we get to the end of uh, lap seven I've caught up with 90s but uh, M77 seven, sorry <laughs> um, is now edging away and I've got to try and keep up with him because he is ridiculously quick he has set the fastest lap to keep up I'm going to have to try and go for a stupid move down here and dive in so quick and make it stick just Oh my god, my car has got the best brakes in the goddamn galaxy. Guess I literally stopped like there was no tomorrow. But as we carry on, we jump to lap 10. And again, M777 is really, really on a, on a charge here, just like me. And he's scarped and he's took on Hans, as it Hans US. And oh, there's been an accident, and that is Rick Slick. We'll go and check that out in a second. We'll see what happened with him in the moment, but we are still trying to be consistent. So we go back to see Rick Slick to see what happens, and he looks like, oh no, yeah. Word of advice to anyone, stay away from the curbs in these cars, because once you're on them, you put, put power down, you are out of there. You have gone completely. So as we carry on then, 
end of lap 10, coming to the last corner. We've got to try and get is there, hand, hands um, down this straight. We'll see. We've got to use a bit of the overtake to see if we can get it down there. It looks like we are. We've got the drive. We're going to go on the outside. Nicely done. No drama. No no worries there. So, as we are, we're going to still try and catch up with him because he's a good couple of seconds up in front. It is a bit of traffic up in front, so hopefully he might get held up there, which gives me the advantage to catch up. But as we carry on, though, we are up to lap 11, and though he's got past one of them, so we again have got to try and make the move as quick as we can to keep the pressure on to. We are now up to ninth. We nearly, nearly took half the grid here as we go again with the Lewis Hamilton overtake. There we go again. Nicely done. No drama. And we've caught up, but he's overtook, um, it's believed, Frenchy, the Canadian Frenchy. He's the guy that we did have the uh, accident at the beginning of the race, so we're going to try and take over him as we merge to lap 13. We're going to go on the outside, he goes defensive. Can I take him on the outside? No. Oh, just about with a little touch on the tyres, but nothing major between us two. There was no retaliation. I think he knows it was a fair uh, overtake. But we go change now for a second stint on soft tyres. And we go back to seventh. So at the moment, we started eighth. We went back down to last. We are now climbed to seventh and we are on our second stint. We are now on lap 17. And we are catching up with Gullick as he's in sixth. And at the moment, allegedly he's in fifth. And I think M777 is in fourth. So he's made more progress than I have. So... Whether we can catch her, we don't know. He might crash. We haven't got a clue yet. We're going to carry on. And we are now right behind Gillig. We're trying to find our way. We're going to try and be patient, keep it nice, not make any uh, silly mistakes as we are on the curve there. And I had to quickly get off the curves, remembering if we're on the curves for too long, the power will just make you spin. So who's that on the left there? Oh my god, that's M777. He's made a big mistake. We're just going to have a check out what happened there. So he comes in, takes the curb, bit more twix acceleration, and here we go, he spins, he completely ruins it. No, he was doing so well. And I think now, yep, he's given up on life. He just thinks that's it. Run over, now he's wheel spinning like mad, which you don't really want to do because you've got no traction whatsoever. But unfortunately, that is really bad. Um, but as we carry on to uh, speak on, this, on that straight as well, we're going to take over. Uh, gut lit. Can we make this done? Yes, we can. There we go, guys. Up into fourth position. D will has hit it again, which makes us into fourth. This is a remarkable recovery of a race here, considering I started eighth, went into last, and now we are fourth. But now we merge to our last lap because, unfortunately, nothing happens for 12 laps. So we do go past the back marker, which was Rick Slick, as he did have a, an accident um, uh, early in the race. But just before we give you that little sneak peek, we did start lapping some people. And there we go, guys. We finish off in fourth. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have enjoyed it, hit that like button. And if you're not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you soon. Take care, guys.